So the next tool that you guys need to know how to use is the barometers that you made. So this tool is able to measure changes in air pressure and the reason behind that is that the air that you put into the canister that you sealed in was at a certain pressure. So depending on how the air pressure outside the can, so like what's up here, relates to this air pressure, this balloon is going to stretch. So when the air up here has a higher pressure, it's going to push down on the balloon. When it pushes down onto the balloon, our straw is going to go up. Sometimes the air pressure out here might drop, and that would pull up on the balloon, which would cause our straw to tip down. The way we're going to measure it is to take a ruler and line it up right by the tip of the straw. So, I have my ruler just totally flat against the counter. We're going to do this outside, but then you can kind of line it up. And I would mark this at 11.8. You can see it's kind of moving around because my hand is moving, but I would say 11.8. Make sure that you measure in the centimeter side so that it's more accurate. We'll do that every single day for the next five days, just so that we can see how it changes. It's not going to give us an exact reading like what we'll get from the weather studio, but it will be able to show us if on Monday we measure at 11.8 and then Tuesday we measure at 12.5, we'll be able to see that the pressure, since the straw went up, the pressure also went up because it pushed down on the balloon, so the straw moved up. All right.